Matuba from Sasa. Yes. yes. Yeah. Oh, oh, look at this. It's the mask that's hiding you. I know, you. it's hiding me. Yes. Ah, you see, you got the best guy yeah. in town. Yeah. You got I'm the too. best guy in I'm town. Too. Yes. I'm so yes. happy Talk to see to you, and I'm, I'm so happy sorry to... you are happy. No, but I'm happy you. that you you <coughs> responded quite quickly when I spoke to your, your CEO yes, to right. say, you know, look, we need to communicate to our people. We need to use our own... Um, uh, systems. Okay. We we need to use our we need to use our own uh, systems without necessarily saying the others. They are they. We we must keep finding how we can work with the media and so forth. Yes. But we need our own systems that can help us tell our people what is happening. And we, I don't know because the I I just think that um, the sociology of the media today is really not helping us from a point of view of helping us educate our people. Nothing wrong with them uh, talking about what's happening, nothing wrong with them digging what they think is not right, but they also have a responsibility to talk to our people about how our own people can help themselves while we help them. And that's very important for me. And I really yeah. loved your climate change angle today. It's very, very important. It's important it's very, very because important. if you can't tell people that uh, in a, in maybe in December, they might not find themselves at the beach, something that they love very well. Then they might and not really appreciate what the danger is. You've got to tell them that look at what it is. The blue was like 10 kilometers away from the beach. The rubbish that was collected there is, is really just almost impossible. Yeah. So it's our responsibility with community leaders uh, to try and bring our people on board in appreciating and understanding a climate change that we we can only change by doing the right thing yes, by nature. Thank you so much. Yes. Thank you so okay. much. Okay. We'll